year's Hall of Fame class finally gets enshrined next weekend. And you obviously played against Kobe, against Timmy, against KG. Other than being three of the toughest guys to ever walk the planet and three of the best players to ever live, was there something else that jumped out at you about those guys, either collectively or individually, just that just separated them and made made greatness even greater? Tough guys, you said. Yeah, well, tough, elite, all of it. Just was there something uh, about two, two, two of those guys? I would probably say I consider tough guys, and that's more so mentally tough. And one of those guys just do a lot of this. That's not <laughs> tough at all. So we we going this this the 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 definition of tough guy. Don't go by guys that do this. You know that, Tim. So I understand. I want to take KG. You probably want to take KG off that tough guy list. Now, great basketball player. <laughs> great basketball player. Yes. Um, you know those guys. Those guys' competitive spirit. Um, you know those guys. Uh, you know the way they led their teams, all in different ways. You know, um, obviously, you know Kobe was a guy that basically said, uh, you know, I'm a lead. I'm going to knock down every wall. I'm going I'm to push every brick. Um, and you guys just get on board and follow. And, and, and if I can implement, you know, my mentality and, and, and my heart into you guys, then we'll be all right. You know, that's the way Kobe, you know, did his thing. I think Tim Duncan quietly was just a quiet assassin. You know, just one of those guys that didn't say much. Um, and those guys probably pissed you off more than anybody. He's not going to talk to you, not going to say much. And at the end of the night, he's going to fry you like chicken. He's going to have 30 or 15 and they're going to win the championship. Um, you know, obviously, KG Tiz is a route that I really don't, you know, condone. You know what I'm saying? A lot of that talking and disrespect. But uh, you can't take away from what he's done on the basketball court and who he's been as a basketball player. Um, obviously, you know, coming in at such a young age um, and from the right from the get go, you know, being able to dominate this game of basketball on both ends of the floor. You know, you talk about two way player. He was one of the first guys to be able to do it at six eleven. You know, talking about guarding one through five and just the way he was disruptive on defense and then took it to the offensive floor and just approached both ends of the game. You know, with the same you know mentality and aggressiveness. So, you know, all those guys are great basketball players and um, you know, God rest the soul of Kobe, man. Um, you know, those guys definitely deserve to be in the Hall of Fame. My, don't be loosely um, throwing, don't be loosely throwing around tough guy, Tim. I understood. To you, there ain't they're all playing for second, and you know this. So you you know that. So I appreciate um, it. I